Hello guys, welcome back to Techatronics. Hope you are liking the contents uploaded in my channel. Everyone will be wondering what will be the content for today. Today's content is exclusively dedicated to all the YouTube creators as well as the social media influencers who are actually looking forward to create quality contents for their web platforms. So let's get started. So the web platform which I'm going to talk about today is FlexClip. So FlexClip is an amazing platform for every social media influencers or creators to create awesome contents. Awesome contents in the sense it can be intros, it can be outros, it can be slideshows, it can be presentations or it can be projects, any kind of things. FlexClip offers AI auto subtitles, millions of royalty free stock media including photos, videos and music. 4K plus exclusively designed templates in diverse categories, cloud storage function for trans devices editing anywhere and anytime, screen recorder, GIF maker and video compressor supported. So there are a lot of contents, lot of premium materials which is available here. So if you can see the flex clip interface, you can see there is an option called personal, different categories. So I'm just going to zoom in. So you can see the categories like personal, right? So under personal, we have birthday, wedding, anniversary, family, travel. So there are different templates which is available in this material. So if you're clicking on birthday, for example, you can see a lot of templates which is available and you can also see the preview of each templates. So by clicking on the preview, you can see it in the full screen how a template looks like. It's amazing, isn't it? So in the template itself, there are different resolutions available, which is 16 is to 9, which is for YouTube, 9 is to 16, or 1 is to 1, which is for other platforms like Instagram or Facebook, which you're looking forward to. So FlexClip has multiple categories, as you can see, like if you are to create intros and outros, you can click on creative intros and outros, trailers, movies, photography, everything is there. So if you are trying to create an intro video or an outro video for your YouTube channel, you can create it over here. So I'm just going to give you a preview about how this thing works. So if you're looking for a gaming intro, you can directly type in gaming intro in the search bar. So it will show you the entire gaming intros which is available. So I'm going to select one of the gaming intros here. I'm just going to click on preview. So in the preview, you can see an overview of how the intro looks like. And uh, you're going to select 16 to 9, which is for YouTube. And we can click on customize. So once you click on customize, it will take you to another window where you will get additional options to edit a particular intro to include your logo, your channel name, or if you want to add more text or elements to it, you can actually do so. So in the media option, you can actually choose to upload your contents like if you want to upload your logo so that you can attach that logo onto the intro you can actually do it by clicking on media so you can i'll just give you a small intro about how to create the intros here so in the game name you double click on that you can get an option to edit it i'm just stating it as master gaming and i'm also gonna say a tagline to it any taglines which you would like to so I'm just mentioning enter the world of cups. Okay, after which I can just play it and see like how it looks like. So this intro will have music embedded in it. You are not able to hear it because I'm actually recording the particular interface. So every intros have its own music embedded. So here you have multiple options like if you want to add templates, if you want to add text, if you want to add subtitles to the video or if you want to add videos or audios to the files, you can actually do it here. So I'm going to click on text. I'm going to choose certain options or certain animations which is available. So I'm going to delete whatever I have created. Okay, so I'm just going to select one of the animations, text animations are available over here. So I'm going to make edits to the name. 
I'm going to name it as Master Gaming. Just that. And I can also choose a style on how you want your channel name to be appear on the intro. So let's see how it goes. I'm going to click on play. So this is another way of creating the intros by using the text animations available in FlexClip. So I'm going to again choose another text animations. The text animations is a peculiar option which we have available exclusively in FlexClip so that you can do not have to select animations separately while creating intros. That's one of the awesome features which is available in FlexClip. So I have selected another option or another text format along with the animation. So I'm going to again name it as World of Games, Master Gaming. So if you want to say it as like Welcome to Master Gaming, the world of games, something like that. And depending upon the intro background, you set the color of your text. So here yeah, the intro video is a little bit very bright. So I'm going to make it so you can see that it looks more awesome right it says welcome to the master gaming the world of games so it looks more awesome intro for you so this is how you can make the intros otherwise if you want to have corporate free materials that's also available in flex clip you can see it under videos you can see it under photos you can see it under audios also there are multiple options of elements as well as overlays which is available in this so if you are creating a stock video for example if you are trying to make a video for stock market you can go directly go to the video i'm going to delete all the contents which i have already made okay so i'm going to select the stock market video over there and so it's very clear to your viewers that you are about to contribute your content towards stock markets right so i'm just going to name the stock market as a the, the stock emperor so i'm going to choose the text animations instead of adding simple text to the video so it will give more viewer attention and also improvise your quality of the content which you deliver hope you have liked the contents which I'm making in the flex clip and definitely it's because of the flex clip templates which we have got because of which I'm going to I'm making this kind of videos without in wasting much time because if you want to create a video which is very good in quality then it's going to take a hell lot of time and look there is elements also if you want to add on elements like if you want to say to the customer that you click on subscribe button it will have that kind of animated elements so you can also add those elements in the video some of those are the subscribe buttons or if you want the customer to subscribe your channel instead of saying it on the video you can actually give the impressions to the customer that this is something that you expect the customer to do if you liked your content likewise there are a lot of premium contents which is available like if you're going to the photo section also you can find a lot of royalty free photos and in the photo section if you are searching for something related to technology you can click on select technology or you can type in technology and you can search for it so it will give you all the royalty free photos which is available which you can use for the video or the contents which you are trying to create so going back to flex clip so here it all the videos that you make which will come under my projects so in from there you can actually download the videos which are without any issues so again like we have multiple options like personal business and all and if you are sliding downwards you can see the multiple options which is available here and if i'm going to choose something like uh, animated sport intro like for example if you are trying to create a video for fitness or MMA so you can download this particular intro directly or if you want to customize it as I mentioned earlier click on the customize option select the aspect ratio and make changes to the existing intro so there are fabulous 
contents which is available in FlexClip. And under creative, like there are many categories which is available. For example, if you are selecting gaming, so there are different aspect ratios available. And if you want to choose an aspect ratio, you can actually do it. And these are the gaming intros which is available in FlexClip, which is straightforward intros. So if you want to make more changes to it, to it you can actually make it. And you can find uh, social media where you, if you want to make any Instagram Reels, you can actually do it by going into social media and clicking on Instagram Reels. So I'm going to click on like cool and makeup. So here I'm going to play this particular video. So you can see the how it comes in. So if you want to customize it, you can obviously customize it with adding text animations or adding videos or adding photos to it. And this also offers the cloud storage where you can actually store the videos or the templates which you have created. So talking about templates, if you want to create your own template, you can click on my templates and you can choose it as create template. So once you click on uh, create template, it will take you to the different page where you have seen before, like all the templates, all the text animations, all the videos, all the photos or all the audios, everything will come over here. So, and if you want to upload your contents from the ones which you have already in your computer, you can actually do so. And once after you create, for example, if I'm selecting an online course promotion video, so I'm going to select it, I'm going to click on replace all. So all the contents which is showing over here, it will come onto the timeline. So once the contents are added to the timeline, so for example, I'm not editing a single content over here. So if you are making any changes to it, you make the changes. Once after making the changes, if the videos are not getting automatically saved, you can click on the save option, which is available in the topmost part of it. So which is next to create as a project. So once you click on the save option, it will gradually start saving the video. So once the video is saved, if you want to save it as a project, you don't have to go back. Once saving is done, you can click, click on create as a project. So once you click on create as a project, you will get an option to export the file. So this is something that you have to do every time once uh, you have completed creating your contents. So here you can see the export option which is available there. Click on export. So once you click on export, you will get different resolutions available starting from 480 pixels to 1080 pixels. So 720 and 1080 pixels are available only for premium plans. So if you are not ready to purchase, then obviously you can download only 480 pixels. But if you are looking for purchases, it's very easy. Uh, you don't have to pay much money for it because it's a little uh, cheaper as compared to the other platforms and it offers premium content. So I should say that you should go for the premium version. FlexClip also provides you with the starter tutorials for every starters they will give you each and every step in this particular document, which is very differentiating FlexClip from other platforms. So here you can see how to add the media files, how to timeline the zooming, and also how to add scenes and how to edit the videos, how to add text animations, how to add music, how to change the background, how to brand your video, how to download it. Each and every information is embedded into this particular document. So every person who is going to use this platform for the first time, they can reference this particular document in order to know more about the features which is available in FlexClip. Hope you like this platform and please make use of it.